Our very chilly start to the day. The temperatures right now are starting out in the 30s in many spots. 36 in Westminster, 36 Jarrettsville. We're also seeing 30s on the eastern shore. So it is possible just about anywhere in the metro you may be waking up to some frost. Maybe not quite as much in Anne Arundel County where the temperatures are mainly in the 40s. Same case towards D.C. Anywhere outside of that, it is cold enough for a lot of frost to show up on the ground and even your car windshield. Skies are clear. The air is dry. Should make it feel a lot more comfortable once the sun is up. Comes up earlier now because of the time change just uh, before 645. By 12 p.m. we're at 43 degrees and then we'll be in the upper 50s by 3 p.m. The sun carries with us uh, through the day, but again the sun sets earlier because of the time change just before 5 o'clock. Temperatures before that should bottom out or top out rather in the upper 50s around Baltimore. 60 for Hagerstown, 61 for D.C. Notice how it's mild in the mountains today, near 60 even out towards Oakland. Warm air is starting to push in from the west and we should enjoy more of that tomorrow. But tonight with the clear skies still chilly, 30s in many spots in the metro and 40s in downtown Baltimore. There's a storm system approaching. Ahead of that, we get a bump of warm air, but once this enters the region on Wednesday, we'll see more clouds and a cool down once again. Future cast shows how we're dry until that happens. High pressure and control through today and tomorrow, so election day looks great for anyone who has to stand in line. We'll have the sunshine, but by Wednesday, more clouds in place and a chance for some showers. Unfortunately, the future cast is kind of uh, taking out some of the rain. It looks really spotty as it comes through. We could really use some rain and re really Wednesday is our next best chance. But with that, a cool push of air not only arriving midweek, another second batch into the weekend. This one a lot colder, really feeling that chill as we head into Saturday. That's the kind of pattern that could also cause flurries in the mountains and through Pennsylvania. We'll keep an eye on it. Temperatures in the 50s today, mid 60s tomorrow. We start to cool again back to a seasonable level through the end of the week. Wednesday, the best chance for showers. For now, they look pretty scattered. The weekend, though, significantly colder, 40s on Saturday.